coming back from a game against LAC, and it was not easy. Ugh, exhausting. So we just gotta make sure we don't crash into anything. And oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Okay. We're good, we're good. Just gotta make sure. Walking around in my Mercerati. Gotta stay awake. Gotta stay awake. Okay, make sure there's no stop sign. Oh wait, that's red! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Stop 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 stop! Oh! Oh wait. I'm an NBA player. I ain't gotta follow the rules. What? Someone deceived me. I'm gonna get Gordon when he comes back. I'm gonna get back to New Orleans. I got his. Uh, oh! We crash, we crash, we crash. Oh my god, we're in trouble. We're. Oh wait. I'm in the NBA, baby! I ain't gotta pay for nothing, baby. What's up, you guys? City Moon, that's what's up. And today, I'm bringing you guys a 2K13 commentary. Now, my topic of today will be started after I go ahead and give you guys a couple of things. I did change up my signature skills in this gameplay. I put on a Deadeye, Acrobat, Posturizer, Microwave, and Gatorade Prime Pack, mainly because by fourth quarter I'd be running out of energy, so Gatorade Prime Pack would help in Microwave. I wouldn't have to worry about doing a lot of stuff, so that's just for that. Now on to the topic. The topic is about PC gaming. And I'm probably going to do another one of these. And I'm going to include a lot of different PC games. But in PC, in general, I think the PC is completely underrated. And I know that some of you guys may go, Well, the Xbox 360 is the best console. PlayStation 3 whoops everybody there. The Wii U is the best, or most likely, majority of people are going to be like, Wii U is for little girls. Which I don't see where that stereotype comes in, but that's a completely different topic. So, I wanted to go ahead and talk about PC, and the good things that you can get out of it. And, you know, I mean, you guys most likely already know the bad, and watch this player here. He gets his stuff beat, I get the rebound. That's where I start off my first rebound of the game, and I end off with a triple-double. So, just saying about that. And... Now back to my topic, I think the PC is severely underrated because people seem to only look at the bad things now. Some of the good things about the PC are mods. Now I know that a lot of you guys are thinking, oh he's a hacker. The thing is a lot of people don't really know that mods are actually good for some games. They're actually good mods, you know. And I know a lot of console players don't really know that because on the Xbox, on the Wii, I think the PS3 knows about this. There are hacks, I mean, everybody knows about it. And look at this Stephen Curry pop-up. But everybody knows about the hacks that, it, and I include this clip to show you guys 56 points per game. And back to the topic, the, the PC, I know that it can get hacked pretty easily, but, and look at this clip, Ugh. fix that 2k, now the PC can get hacked pretty easily, and that's actually a good thing, because I mean, there are good mods, kind of like the scoreboard mod that I had, where I had ESPN scoreboard, and I don't know why it disappeared in this gameplay, but I'm gonna probably switch that to T, in T, so you know, there are, there are different types of mods, I mean, not every mod is always gonna be bad. Now, I know that people that play Call of Duty have to deal with aimbots and things like that. But, I mean, you have to think more of the positives, especially when it comes down to PC gaming. And, now, the other topic I want to talk about is accessibility. And... One thing I want to talk about that is how you guys know how Xbox has the marketplace, Sony has the store, Wii U and or well, Wii U has the eShop, the Wii has the Wii Shop channel, and you guys know about that. But I think that the PC is a little more accessible because of things like Steam, where they give you things like a free weekend of playing in the game. I mean, that that's what draws a lot of people to Steam. And now I know I bought it because of some of that, but a, a lot mainly because of the things that you can buy. And how 
I think that it's somewhat a good thing that it's PC rate gaming is underrated, because I mean, cheaper games. I ain't paying 60 bucks. Ugh. Usually I try to find a bargain. But, you know, that, that can be a good thing, and look at me, 13 assists per game. But, that, that can be an advantage that it's underrated, but I mean, the accessibility is amazing on PC. The free games you can get, like Warframe and Tribes Ascend, and how you insert stuff, you can get all these DLC packs and everything, and there are, every, everything just seems to be a little more accessible, like the files. I know, like I said earlier, it is easy to hack PC, but it also it makes it easier to do things on PC that sometimes you can't do with just the internet. And another thing for PC is that, speaking of the internet, it's it's more able to get to the internet, depending, we're, we're going to say depending on, because I mean a lot of people don't have internet, so I have to take that into consideration, but majority of the time it's a good thing because you're able to upload gameplay while you're playing or you can like live stream. And the other thing I want to talk about with PC gaming is how it runs. The PC runs very smoothly, and there's my 10th rebound to get my triple-double, but the PC runs very smoothly, and I know that when you watch my clips, you will see a lot of lag, but that is usually not the game or the PC. That tends to become more because you're recording, because whenever I play 2K13 by myself, I usually don't have any problems, or when I play Warframer. Tribes of Sin, but you do lag if you do record, so I mean, that's just a matter of things that are going on at once, so, I mean, as I said, the PC is completely underrated in my opinion, it, it would be my favorite console, and that's my 100 three-pointer, but the PC is my favorite console, and I know that some of you guys are like, really, I thought you were a Nintendo fan, and yes, I do love Nintendo. He's guarded by Udra. And I think that the, but that's going to be a different topic, but I think that the problem is with the PC is that it doesn't get enough exposure. And that's a problem. I think that the PC really needs to be introduced. I know a lot of people don't really know what the PC can actually use for gaming. And another thing is that people that play, a lot of people that know about PC think that they have to buy this $600 PC, and that's just ridiculous. I, mean, I, I use on a laptop and there's it really runs well and so i just hate it when people seem that whenever i'm on black ops 2 and i'm talking to people like in the bro clan or troy and they're always talking about like these gigantic computers and i'm like okay I i'm i'm pretty smart but i don't know what the hell you're talking about so <laughs> but that's the end of the game so look at sudibun korea player of the game we had 62 points, 13 rebounds, 15 assists, 6 steal, 1 block, 1 tur 5 turnovers, and a foul. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later. do 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 see Don't think I don't know it. I deserve that award this week, just like I did the other times. And I'll deserve it again next week when you guys are inevitably asking me this same question. It goes with the territory of being the best player in the league. I'm used to it by now.